Hello everyone, it's Jesse here. 12-6-2015, 10.54pm. It's really cold out. Um, not as cold as it was the other night, but very cold. I was told, okay, I went to my grandparents today and spent some time up there. Uh, Mom just, she hung out here, uh, made some crock pot food, and gave me the chance to go up there and spend about, I think I spent about two hours up there. Uh, which is good because I hadn't talked to, to them like in length in like that long for in ages. Um, other than that, I had a, I've had a pretty full day other than going up there. But anyways, that the full day is not something I want to talk about. <laughs> um, just dealing with pe people around here in this area. Uh, anyways, people like to drop by uh, unannounced and it's just not cool. I don't like that. If you're gonna drop by the property, you need to either call me on the phone. That's Starlight, by the way. She wants out, and she will probably continue to bark until I go and let her out. So you will probably hear her bark several times throughout this video because I'm not restarting it. Um, but yeah, like shoot me a text, shoot me a Facebook message, shoot me a phone call. If you are that close to my circle, don't just show up unannounced. It's just not cool to show up unannounced. Uh, I don't think anybody likes people to show up unannounced at their home. But anyways. Um, spent good time up there with my grandparents. Let me tell you what. Um, you know, I talk about how my grandfather, he is wealthy, and, and he is wealthy. And um, he, he's a physician, and he's been a physician for over 50, for, for like 60 years. So he saved his money and stuff. So he has stocks and bonds and just un, unimaginable unimaginable amount of stuff. Um, I think his, nah, I'm not even going to say that because that's a little bit of going into his, that's his business really. But anyways, um, I, was, I was looking at my grandma, I was like, damn, are you going, I asked her, I said, are you going out tonight? Are y'all planning on going dancing or something? At a country club from around, you know, far. She said no. They were eating steak and potato. Of course, they eat like that all the time, like really good. Um, she had her diamonds on. She had a ring on each finger. She had a necklace on. She had ear do, two earrings on. She had studs in and dangling di diamonds. And I was like... Did you just wake up today and decide you want to put on all of your fancy jewelry? She goes, no, I just like to put on my jewelry and come sit and eat. I was like, okay. Do you know if you go anywhere with all this on you, it's not a good idea, right? And she was like, yeah, I know better than to leave with all the jewelry on me. She'll leave with a earrings, necklace, and a ring. Her wedding ring. But her jewelry stunned me because I hadn't seen some of that stuff before and it's the reason I haven't is because it's like it's brand new um my grandfather purchased um some two carat earrings for her um they're yellow so they were quite expensive I think he said twelve thousand dollars or more and that was a deal and she had a necklace on that was new and I was like when they told me how much that cost I was like oh my god like oh my god freaking out it was twenty two thousand dollars for the necklace and the chain for the the diamond and the chain it's like a three carat diamond and I was like, when did y'all buy this? Oh, and he said, oh, it's just the other day. I'm like, why? If she's got, you know, no offense or anything, dog, but you know she's got enough jewelry to last her lifetime. And he said, oh, she can't ever get enough diamonds. Blew my mind. When he said $22,000, I just, just almost pissed myself. I was like, really? Because you know what I could do with $22,000?
I could live for the next five years or more on that much money. Because I'm currently living on less than $400 a month. It just blew me away. I, I just couldn't, I didn't even want to talk about the rest of it, like all of the rings on her finger. And then I got to talking about um, the woman named Shirley Strawn. If you ever look her up, you can look, up, look her up on the internet. She lives here in the, this county. She goes and she goes to hunt, hunts diamonds every day of the week that they're open. She has for 20 years. She has thousands of diamonds that were found here in the diamond mine here. And um, I wanted, uh, I mentioned to my grandma that I wanted them to try to get like five that were found here. Maybe probably the black diamond, uh, which is the most common and not as pretty. But it's still technically a diamond and it was still made here in my town, in this crater. And uh, the smallest of flecks, just a fleck of it, just a little bitty, like a point ten, you know, really tiny. I want like five of them so I can do a giveaway and give, give them away to you guys. And my grandpa said, oh, she'd probably charge you an arm and a leg for just five little bitty tiny ones like that, which is probably true. Um... She's kind of, she hoards her money, and but that's beside the point. What does that sound? Skip it. Get on the hunt. Is it the rat? Is it the mouse again? Skip is right up in it. I don't know if y'all could hear that sound. That damn mouse is back. It must not be stuck back there because because it it uh. I guess it like no it's like it likes to gnaw on some kind of wood that I've got in here. Anyways, beside that. Um I did a shout out video for this weekend. It went up on Sunday today. And uh I, I said Meg's blogs Oz, but it's Mez Blogs Oz. That that's the right. It's Mez, not Meg's. I'm dyslexic. I, I learned how to how to uh I learned how to read and write, write correctly uh, through much hell, getting over the dys dyslexia, but I still type backwards sometimes and I also write down words that do not make sense. And like, I, like it, you might not be able to see it, but the first one, I put Megs instead of Mez. Sorry about that, hun. Um, something really great happened over the weekend. I got this in the mail. Guess what this is? This is my first YouTube check. Very first one, and it's for $110.92. So, when they told me that they went through Disney, I thought, what? You going through Disney for what? So I thought, oh hell, this this my my uh, network's just fucking with me or something. And no, they really go through Disney Worldwide Services Incorporated. And I also got my first card in the mail. I'm gonna try to pronounce this, but it's not gonna be right. I'm gonna get the first part right, but not the second part. Gemini Saba or Saba? Gemini Saba. Maybe it's all one word. Gemini Saba. She's probably laughing at her, laughing at me. But uh, I know what I'm gonna do with this. It's like a sticker, a reflective sticker. Thank you very much. I'll be sending you one out soon. Or you will be receiving yours soon. Um, other than that, I've had a, a pretty decent day. Just been really busy. I've got like 26 videos to watch in my watch later list. Um, that's a low for the weekend. Usually I'm by the end of Sunday. You know, I kind of take Saturday and Sunday as like, or Friday, Saturday, and Sunday as like down days. And so usually they pile up on me, but I've actually watched a lot of videos yesterday, 
which is surprising. I was just, but it was so cold that I didn't, there was nothing I could do. I, I wasn't going out back to play with the dogs and freeze my ass off. Um, so I was just kind of stuck in the house. And when somebody gave me a link to a website that you can watch movies, and I thank you very much for that. Because I didn't have anything like that. <laughs> and I don't like Nick, everything, anything on Netflix. Like, I've still got to watch Orange is the New Black on Netflix, the season that's out. But the rest of everything on Netflix, I'm not, not a big fan of Netflix. Not just that, I mean, I'm a fan of some of the shows that are on there, just not a fan of the site Netflix. Um, and who knew that Crackle is putting out new content, like recent content, and their own web series. I don't know what series it was a commercial for, but Crackle is going into series making, and it, the series piqued my interest, so I'm going to have to go to Crackle and see if they've got it up yet. I don't know if anybody else has used, used Crackle before, but you can watch like old movies and stuff like that on there. Um, nothing like New Day right after, right out of theaters, right off to, to sale, you know. But anyways, um, I'm going to be going to Hot Springs soon, because i got to go to the dentist. And if I do, I will vlog driving. Uh, Yeah, I'll have to vlog driving because I don't want to vlog after I get my tooth pulled because I'm going to be got galls in my mouth and stuff like that. So maybe I'll, I'll vlog driving. It's not like a real scenic route or anything. It's not really much to see. But I'll try to if I can remember to bring the camera with me when I go to the dentist. But anyways, um, like I just, before I started this video, I just finished re responding to every single comment and oh my god, I had 40, I'd say 40 comments to approve and go through and reply to. That took a long time. So like it's now 11.06. So I've been vlogging for 12, over 12 minutes now. So, uh, I'm going to let you go. No more rambling for me. Oh, by the way, Bonnie, Bonarchy7, thanks for that reply video. It was awesome. Um, I didn't mean for it to turn into like a history lesson, but uh, I knew that y'all probably didn't have any idea about anything in, in Arkansas, the, in, uh, the indigenous people or anything like that. Um, so I kind of wanted to read that to y'all. And um, did you know that Illinois is not Illinois, it's Illinois. I learned that a long time ago. My mom is from Indiana, which is right next to Illinois. Um, but I think if I look it up, it probably the French had something to do with that too. Naming it the silent S on the end, like the silent S on Arkansas. So, anyways, I've loved, I've, I've, I've got blah, 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 hello. I have so many videos like that <laughs> piled up that I'm just rambling and can't speak. But um, I'll let you go. Peace. I love you guys, and I'll see you on the next one.